to another episode of whatever's called mukbanging around the show where we taste anything and everything that's tasty in the world today i am the homer simpson of this show daniel paul crow and on this episode finally got my hands on a can of duff now obviously it's not duff beer because uh well i've been sober for so many years now but this is a lorange uh sparkling beverage because this is uh so sold in a candy shop um specifically um a candy shop in parkmore here in victoria i just can't remember for the life of me what the store was called but uh they sold me this thing and um yeah very interested to see what it tastes like uh, for four bucks it better be good because uh, most uh, cans are about two dollars uh, for a regular soda but you know this is a novelty thing um hopefully it's good and let's see why homer simpson and simpsons like it even though it's alcoholic so remember drink duff responsibly here we go <coughs> all right so i do apologize i have a little bit of a cold at the moment so my nose is blocking me up Ooh, okay. That is a weird looking orange soda. Kind of looks like a very sickly orange soda. Ooh, that's a very interesting smell. Even with a block guys, I can smell that. Alright, cheers. It's not bad. So it's it's a it's sparkling water, um, with a hint of orange. Uh, it's not something I would drink all the time, um, but definitely very inter very interesting um, taste. Um, look, for four bucks, it's not really worth it, but uh, you know, it tastes actually really really good for something that's sparkling water. Um, yeah, so I'm going to say, the exception of the price, the exception of the price, um, Duff, uh, a l'orange, sparkling beverage, is cool, um, it just, it's not something I drink all the time, um, I've actually stopped drinking soft drinks, uh, this is the first, uh, soft drink I've had in, oh, about two weeks, I think, so, it is not too bad, so I'm going to say it's cool, um, yeah, if you want to check it out, you know, try try to find it. it. If we're here in Australia, it's usually in American um, candy shops or novelty uh, candy stores that have them, um, and they're about four bucks. So definitely check it out. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel, and enable those notifications to stay up to date whenever we post anything. If you can't wait for our next video, make sure to check our podcast. It is available wherever you get your podcasts. And until next time, we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.